My name's Rima, I am 29 years old. I have had MS since November 2015. Before my diagnosis, I was like every other young 20 year old, you know. I was active, um, I was able to, you know, work, I was able to go out, I was able to drive. You know, it was just, it was just like a, a fun, buzzing life. Getting that diagnosis, I was scared. I was scared of obviously ending up in a wheelchair. Then I booked a consultation with Dr. Kazmi, explained my diagnosis and how my symptoms had been and just how bad I was getting. And he put me forward for HSCT privately at London Bridge Hospital. I definitely felt hope after meeting him. That was a huge turning point in my life. It's a life transformational treatment you're about to go into and it's not to be taken lightly but I felt like I was in the best and safest hands. It almost happened like clockwork. When they said certain things would be felt, that's when I felt them. When they said certain things would happen, that's when they would happen. And it was the most amazing experience for me. I think from every single person I dealt with, from my chemotherapy nurses, the physiotherapists, the dietitians, even the people that bring my lunch. Like, Every single person put such a huge smile on my face and I felt really safe and secure and I just really felt like the people that I was with were 100% aware of how to help me and how to do what was right for me at that time. Since my transplant, I feel like a lot has changed in my life in so many different ways. I feel like I'm a complete different person. Physically, the changes that I've noticed a lot are um, I'm able to walk unaided, I'm able to run after my son, I'm able to cook, um, I wasn't able to use my right hand for long periods of time, I'm able to carry my child. I think there's definitely moments I forget I have MS. I feel just like everyone else. So I'm so incredibly appreciative of everyone at London Bridge Hospital. It's given me a second chance at life and if it weren't for them, I don't know what position I'd be in right now from how things were going. So I, I will eternally be grateful for everything they've done for me.